sudden occurrences, excitement, intense actions leading to drastic changes mark the week of July the 15th to the 21st. What else can we expect? This is what we shall find out here today. Good morning, bonjour, Michel Karen, astrologer, shaman. Welcome to my channel dedicated to the practical uses of astrology to lead a better life. Monday, July the 15th, Mars is conjunct Uranus. Today, a quick succession of events happening without any warning, unexpected events, and sudden upsets make it difficult to make any plan. Self-willed, intensely rebelling against any kind of restraint, unafraid to face danger and craving freedom and excitement, we could take a very direct, blunt approach, make drastic decisions and engage in reckless actions. Our rebelliousness towards any kind of routine is explosive. Resources are called upon at a moment's notice, requiring quick decisions. Lacking patience, we are likely to be brutally frank, obstinate, intolerant, scattered, maybe erratic, compulsive, and unable to relax. Engaging in daredevil sports, reckless driving, thrill-seeking activities, or a hazardous job may feel very attractive, but with this transit, is not really recommended. We should also stay away from jets, rockets, firearms, heavy machinery, and electrical devices, which could potentially lead to accidents. And shall also do well to avoid headstrong people prone to violence, whose temper may be unpredictable. Rash actions, sudden hostility, or an eccentric attitude could unexpectedly severe a uh, friendship. But by the same token, we could also meet new, stimulating, magnetic people. Whether they do or do not stay in our lives, they spark new, dynamic, liberating interests. We feel the need to identify with innovative, revolutionary projects that we can pour all our time and energy into that enable us to develop along unconventional lines. Our healing and intuitive powers are enhanced, likely to be fascinated by science, astrology, electronics, economics, humanitarian reforms, aviation, and politics. We aim at goals that seemed previously impossible to reach and do not hesitate to put up a fight to achieve our dreams. Thursday, July the 18th, the Sun is sextile Uranus, a day to expect the unexpected. Plans are disrupted for the better, exciting, creative changes occur, and interesting situations arise. Our enthusiastic drive, magnetism, and altruistic disposition enhance our charisma, making us popular and leading to a dynamic social life. Unusual groups stimulate our curiosity. This is excellent for meeting or contacting influential people. Our sense of timing is impeccable. Our command and the intuitive insights that come to us in flashes of lightning are impressive. Ingenuity leads to success. Our increased self-confidence, originality, and personal expression help us develop our leadership abilities. This transit is excellent for furthering independent enterprises. Really good also for any form of intellectual activity, creativity, and inventions. We grasp ideas quickly, our thinking is progressive, and whatever is outmoded, we have a strong need to reform even revolutionize. <laughs> Impulsivity is great, but should not be overdone as we could easily burn bridges and alienate those who care for us. But we definitely rebel against those who may have high expectations of us, restrict our independence, and we should be careful not to express our nervous energy too erratically. Let's be very attentive while driving. It is a day to be extra present to the present, flexible and free. A great friendship may turn into an unusual romance that welcomes and embraces our uniqueness, as well as both challenges and expands our ideas. As long as we listen to the voice of reason, this transit is also positive for financial speculations based on original concepts. 
Saturday, July the 20th, Mars enters Gemini until September 4. The next month and a half brings changes in the way we express anger, leadership, courage, pursue our goals, respond to threats and insults, and generally interact with others. We are likely to have all kinds of questions and are eager to study, diversify our interests, and take on a new training. We might find ourselves changing careers or working multiple jobs simultaneously. We are more assertive, intelligent, resourceful, and direct in our speech, as well as able to develop ingenious strategies to achieve our goals. Not afraid to try new ways of approaching things, we give ourselves the freedom to explore different options and develop our talents. We are excited to experiment, revealing new possibilities. It's a period of inspiration as well as excitement and brilliant ideas. We are willing to work longer hours on the project we are passionate about, are talkative and enthusiastic. A great transit to sell an original idea and right all the wrongs we see around us. More specifically, on Saturday, July the 20th, Mars is sextile Neptune. We may experience many changes, some of which we don't have much control over, but that open interesting new horizons. We could also feel a certain restlessness or dissatisfaction that makes us want to try something we've never done before and seek new opportunities. Our fertile imagination, awareness of possible subtle developments, and heightened intuition enable us to remain one step ahead. Meaningful, creative artistic pursuits are encouraged. We definitely combine talent and inspiration, but should be careful that our life's aims are not unrealistic, that we remain organized and our dreams are supported by real work. Visions that do not motivate action tend to fade into the sunset. We may go into projects full steam just to see them disintegrate if we don't put all the practical efforts to make them concrete. We could also realize that the course of action we had been following no longer serves a real purpose. In order to bypass obstacles or opposition, we may have to carry out some of our projects in secrecy, work behind the scenes, and guard the privacy of our own interests. It is also important that we have integrity, are emotionally controlled, very honest and forceful without being too pushy. Not easily fooled, we are able to detect insincerity in others and are protected from adversity and deceit. Our sexual expression is gentle and loving, our sensitivity is enhanced, our compassion and desire to selflessly help others get back on their feet encouraged. Dancers, actors, filmmakers, yogis, healers, psychics, strategists, designers, original creators, anybody also involved in the work involving the ocean or charitable endeavors are favored. Our gay or psychic friends are stimulating. It's more a day to retreat, meditate, and spend time in contemplation. Sunday, July the 21st is loaded with four planetary aspects. First, Venus takes out Jupiter, a very expensive beneficial transit. We know how to put others at ease, are warm-hearted, generous, kind, graceful, and charming. Social activities and partnerships of all kinds are favored. As long as we exercise discrimination, a pleasurable, relaxed, light-hearted get-together with pleasant friends is favored. We are patient, courteous, popular, admired by others, enjoy entertaining, and are excellent hosts. Our optimism, serenity, and a happy disposition attract abundant affection and the approval of others. New friendships with high-spirited, ethical people bring growth and enrichment. We are content and at peace with the world and are likely to receive many gifts and favors. Our taste is impeccable. We see comfort, harmony, 
balance, excellent for businesses dealing with luxury items, acquiring expensive furniture, getting a makeover or buying nice clothes. Cultural endeavors as well as artistic activities are also encouraged. We could be drawn to religious art forms. Our creative talents are enhanced. Financial affairs are very beneficial, excellent for a foreign investment and planning for our material future. We spend money on quality items that beautify our home or our person. Good fortune is ours if we remain careful to not fall prey to extravagance or excesses. Legal matters are likely to turn to our advantage. This is also a very good day for a long distance trip that adds value to our consciousness. And still on Sunday, July the 21st, Mercury is square Uranus. Today our mind is more active, original, even rebellious, definitely quick and unpredictable. We could argue just for the sake of asserting our difference, yet Jumping to conclusions without having sufficient information or practical experience could make us waste a large amount of valuable energy. We could act in erratic and scattered ways, nervous tension, delays, frustrations, and eccentric goals are to be expected. We could become our own worst enemy. In our attempts to resolve a difficulty, we are likely to attract awkward pred predicaments that create even greater problems. Our circumstances could be out of sync, break our usual patterns of behavior, and expose us to explosive new information. We are drawn to original, independent, and dynamic people, yet could alienate others through tactless remarks intellectual conceit or extreme opinions expressed without thinking. Exceptional insights, bright ideas, and nonconformist concepts challenge long-cherished attitudes. We are likely to be drawn to study an unusual topic. The belief that we are special could make us overestimate ourselves and undermine our very real talents. This is not a good day for traveling or signing any document that has long-term consequences. Breakdowns in communication caused all at once by snap judgments, rapidly changing views, obstinacy, and egotism can cause disagreements and in extreme cases lead to a scandal. Our independence could cause a separation from someone close or we could unexpectedly meet a new, different, exciting person who introduces us to unusual activities and social circles. Nothing is likely to turn out the way we planned. Haste, sudden interruptions, unexpected changes of plans and a certain lack of regard for truth and practicality do not make this a good day for traveling or following through on projects. On Sunday, July the 21st, still Sun, Trine, Neptune. The changes that are initiated by this transit could be so subtle that we hardly notice them. Our enthusiasm, empathy, psychic abilities, and intuition are greatly enhanced. We could have visionary dreams. Our idealism is stimulated. The more we flow with life, our sympathetic, tolerant, and sensitive to undercurrents, the deeper our insights into business, the stock market, our music and religion will be. Our social life tends to increase and could even bring wonderful new friendships, romantic opportunities, even the possibility of an ideal love. Coming into contact with interesting people from varied horizons, helping children by appealing to their imagination and engaging in exciting travel adventures is inspiring and increases our self-confidence. Those who express their creativity through poetry, music, cinema, ballet, theater, or literature, performers and entertainers in general are favored by this transit. Even if we are not particularly artistically inclined, we still feel dreamy and are likely to be touched deeply by an exhibit, a concert, a movie, or a novel. Our tolerance, compassion, instinct for being at the right place at the right time, lack of selfishness, calm consideration, ability to forgive and receptivity are great for guiding others, especially spiritually. 
And finally, still on Sunday, July the 21st, Mars is trying Pluto. Our power and energy are hugely intensified. We understand our own motivations, deeply recognize the areas within ourselves that are dark and in need of change, and are able to eliminate anything outmoded or non-essential from our lives through dynamic, brave, purposeful action. Because our leadership abilities are so strong that we influence others just through our mere example, it is absolutely essential that we come from a place of wanting the highest good. Eliciting the cooperation of others comes easily, and as we reform and renovate what no longer works, we can accomplish amazingly constructive achievements that can improve both our personal lives and the world at large. Fighting injustice, standing for our principles, demonstrating courage, being honest and decisive are powerful tools that enable us to die to the old and be reborn to our truth with maturity, a sense of responsibility and a greater consciousness of our real needs. Scientific research, technological progress, professional efficiency and spiritual work are greatly favored. We leave no stone unturned in our research, are not afraid of exploring even the darkest recesses of our lives. Desire, hostility, possessiveness, and jealousy. With courage and integrity, this transit can help us grow in massive ways. If you are already subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. Your comments are always appreciated. If you enjoyed this video, don't hesitate to place a thumbs up and hit the little bell to be notified when I upload a new video every Thursday and sometimes another time during the week. Remember as always, choose your battles, walk in beauty. Thank you for watching. Until next time. <music>